Hi, this is Colin, and this is my pile of, another pile of cassette tapes video. I don't really have a huge pile to show you that I picked up recently, but um, it's probably a good thing because i got to keep these videos under 15 minutes now. <laughs> um, that's another story. You probably, if you watch back on my videos, you've seen i got a YouTube uh, strike. So I don't know how long that goes on. How how long is a strike forever? Do you just have a strike forever? Somebody maybe somebody out there can tell me. I I could look you know look it up probably and watch somebody's video. It'd just be easier for somebody to tell me. Um. Yeah, but yeah. Uh, I've got some uh, picked up a few tapes over the. Uh, last few weeks. Just a few though. I don't have a whole bunch of them. Oh. How do you like my glasses? I, I wear, this, this is going to be my my tape video glasses. It makes my huge they make my huge pumpkin head seem a little smaller. Because <laughs> you know I do have a huge like pumpkin head like that or you know and all that. But I'll just get right to the tapes because I want to keep this short. And first tape uh, Bon Jovi, keep the faith. Bon Jovi is actually still around, as you all know. There's about the only time I hear his music now is on the country stations. I guess he's kind of worked his way into the country genre, crossed over, I guess you could say. That's kind of a weird, it's kind of a backwards crossover because usually the country people will cross over to rock, mostly, I would think. But Bon Jovi's went the other way around and still picking up his. Uh, Teenage fan base, I guess, in the uh, country realm. The guy never ages. <laughs> anyway, that's Bon Jovi. Gotta get going here. Uh, Nirvana. There's some Nirvana right there. I, I had this tape back in the early 90s, along with some others. But, um,. For some reason, you know how long you play tapes over and over, they usually wear out. And I seen this, and I went ahead and picked it up because now you just don't really see their cassette tapes, at least around here where I live. That's Nirvana. One story: I went to their concert at uh, the the KU Kansas University Ballroom back in the early '90s, before they were famous. I paid seven dollars to get in, and it was a great show. This is before they blew all up, you know, real big. Um, but I don't exactly remember what the album was called, but they played all the music from, you know, the, the cassette or the album with the baby swimming underwater. It was a great show, and I remember being in the mosh pit, and after I got home, I was like looking in the mirror. And I had a boot print right, right on my forehead where, I don't know, somebody had been, you know, where they used to carry people stage or whatever they called it over the, uh, but anyway, I had a shoe print right on my forehead from being in the mosh pit. Yes, this old man used to be in the mosh pits years ago. Another story for you. Okay, back to the 80s, Michael Jackson. A lot of people don't like Michael Jackson, but I do. Um, his personal life might have been messed up, or he might have been kind of strange, but, you know, I still like his music. That's all I'll say about that. Um... Uh, Johnny Rivers, two cassette.
Turkey set. Turkey set Johnny Rivers. Sixties. Mostly played a lot of live shows at the Whiskey A Go Go. Whiskey A Go Go. I think the Doors played there too, didn't they? Uh, at least in that movie. I remember seeing the Doors. Um, the one with Val Kilmer. He was playing at the whis They were playing at the Whiskey A Go Go, and he wouldn't face the stage or face forward. He was like. Turn backwards, kind of like me. I wear all these disguises. I don't want too scared to uh, talk. I feel more comfortable talking in these various get-ups. Another one. The Cure. Does it remember The Cure? This one is. Well, it's The Cure. Another. My best friend used to love these guys back in college, and so that's why I have that right remember here. I'm going to turn this tape over. It's a little uh, muffled on one side. So let's see if it's any better on the other one. I'll just put the cure on. It's background music. I'm not doing any copyright infringement type of nonsense here. Background music, right? <laughs> so I'm going on seven minutes. What I was trying to play there was um, Men at Work, another 80s. Everybody seen this album in the dollar bin? If you, if you don't have it, pick this record up on tape. You know, it's always in the dollar bin. This was 50 cents. Good record. This one and Card Girl are probably my two favorites from Men at Work. And this was my uh, best friend JoJo's, one of his favorite bands, and he passed away uh, a year ago. Miss you, JoJo. This one's for you, even though I couldn't play it too well. And what else we got? Beck. Beck Mellow Go. Another good one from the 90s. I used to have this also, but it got played so much that um, Actually, um, um, I got rid of a lot of my cassettes, but recently I've been picking them back up. And I even have my Sony Walkman. Or not mine, but you know, I picked up another one in the, at the uh, Google store or someplace. That Mellow Gold. OMC. Pick this up because of JoJo again. It's got Al Bizarre on it. Al Bizarre. We used to ride around his. Well, this is a what? 90s? We used to ride around his 70 something Monte Carlo and he'd be plat blasting at the Zop. Is that that one? Another one for Joe. Joe F and Joe. And who doesn't remember? Maybe you don't have this in your collection. If you don't, pick it up. Genesis. That's another, that's another, you always see this in the dollar bins, pick it up if you don't already have it. And I guess that's the end of my pile of cassette videos. Once again, I'm playing my cassette on this whole player. What?
It's on my little iPhone. I got my little iPhone speaker plugged into it. I don't have an iPhone, I just use a speaker. Thanks a lot. Hope you made it this far. I know some of my. Uh, if you don't like my my videos with the you know the the last one I was wearing that crazy mask and everything. I admit that was me. That's a, that's another character. Alter ego soda. Or this is kind of alter ego too. But I guess I have several. You don't have to watch my videos. Just don't watch them. You don't have to leave um, uh, disturbing comments and things. There's you have an unsubscribe button on your computer or whatever. You know, just unsubscribe and don't watch my videos anymore. Thanks, Colin. Over now.